The opening weekend of March Madness comes to a close and people all across the city have been enjoying those games. A lot of them watching him right here in the Bottle Works District this past weekend. You can see it's not very crowded here tonight. Not really uh, a lot of people here at all, but a very different story this weekend leading to the health department cracking down all across the city. This is video of the same area Saturday night as large crowds gathered to watch the tournament. And then as soon as it got more crowded, we kind of stepped away and let people kind of do their thing. Doing their thing for some fans meant not wearing masks and not distancing. This couple left before it got too crowded. It seemed to get more packed as the day went on and people drank more and people <laughs> kind of felt a little bit less like they needed to wear their mask. The Marion County Health Department issued a violation for Saturday's gathering as part of spot checks they're doing to make sure safety protocols are being followed. It definitely seemed like the next day they probably understood what they needed to do better to accommodate people wanting to feel safe. The health department is in the process of issuing three more violations but haven't said where. So far there hasn't been any significant uptick in complaints. The health department is also adding more staff in and around downtown in the coming days and weeks to make sure restaurants and bars are following the guidelines like wearing a mask even outdoors when social distancing isn't possible. But you still kind of want to keep your distance. We've been doing it for a year, so you have all those mental like six feet apart, wash your hands, wear your mask. So you keep those in mind, I guess. Simple measures the health department says can help prevent the virus from spreading. Keeping in mind the city's next big event, the Indy 500, is right around the corner.